So our scripture reading this morning comes from Romans chapter 13, beginning at verse 8. Let no debt remain outstanding except the continuing debt to love one another. For whoever loves others has fulfilled the law. The commandments, you shall not commit adultery, you shall not murder, you shall not steal, you shall not covet, and whatever other commandment there may be, are summed up in this one command. Love your neighbor as yourself. Love does no harm to a neighbor, therefore love is the fulfillment of the law. So I think a lot of times, uh, many of us have experienced the use of the moral principles laid out in scripture, we've experienced the use of those principles as almost a club or a weapon to uh, attack people and make yourself feel more righteous than others, somehow above other people. But the fulfillment of the law isn't in showing that you're better than other people. The fulfillment of the law is in showing that you love other people, that you're looking out for the interests of others. And this passage, which is uh, the epistle reading for tomorrow's uh, sermon on Sunday, this passage is just a reminder, if you want to be righteous, if you want to fulfill the law, as it were, then what you have to do is think about others, is to love others. And it's a sad thing in this world that many of us do not feel like we are loved. And, and, and in fact, some of us are not loved. And if you find yourself in that situation and you want love in your life, the one thing that you can have any say in is whether or not you put love into life. And so, there are, there are a lot of needs out there. There are You're going to be in contact with people, and if you love them, then you're bringing love into the world. And perhaps in your world, that's not something that you've seen a lot of, so now you have an opportunity to go and put some love into the world, fulfill the law. This is what God wants from us, is to relate to others in a way that is loving. So. I hope you enjoy this thought from the beach this morning. I appreciate your taking time to be with me. God bless.